All right, what's up guys? Welcome back to another five minute maintenance video. Today we are gonna be doing an oil change on a 2019 Ford Explorer with the inline four engine. And the items needed to complete this job is six quarts of 5W30 synthetic motor oil, a Motorcraft FL910S filter, 15 millimeter wrench, a rag, a funnel, and also an oil filter wrench. In my case, I did the oil filter change last time and I didn't over tighten it, so I'll probably be able to get it off. And also you're gonna need a piece of cardboard and a drain bucket. Let's get started. Okay, so here under the hood, the first thing we're gonna do is locate our dipstick and our oil fill. Our oil fill is right here. And as you can see, 5W30. So we'll just get that open, sit it right on top. And our dipstick is right here. This is what the view looks like right here. That's your oil filter. Luckily it just hangs. It's not one of those upside down filters that makes a mess. And right on the other side right there, that's gonna be your oil drain. And we're gonna take our 15 millimeter wrench. We're gonna crack it loose. And now just like my last video, the engine's been sitting overnight, so everything's in a pan. So I'm gonna let it drain now. Oh yeah, perfect. This oil has had 5,000 miles on it. The last oil I used was Pennzoil Platinum Full Synthetic. I changed my oil at a 5,000 mile interval. So now I'm gonna let this drain. I'm gonna give it about 10 minutes. With the oil at a slow drip, we can now put our drain plug back in. Hope you can see a little bit better. I'm trying to mock up the GoPro in different places. So we just put that in, like so. And like the last video, 15 foot-pounds. If you don't have a torque wrench, it's tight. And then a little bit more. I'm gonna remove the oil filter, which is located right here. And you just kind of have to grab it and muscle it off. So, okay. Sometimes you could just go like that see it leaks all over the place sometimes I just go fast drop it down there it is now let me get my hand over the lawn before it goes all over my driveway okay now just like my last video what we're gonna do is we are going to pre-fill the oil filter because it hangs upright so we get our new FL 910s open it up I like to push the tabs down so they don't pop up while you're trying to put oil in it. Now we have our 5W30 full synthetic and there's a massive wasp behind me. Oh my God. Perfect. Now take our finger, get a little bit of oil and lubricate the seal. That way it doesn't bind when you're tightening it and create leaks. Just a thin film of oil on the seal. Perfect. Okay, so with the oil drained and our oil filter off, we can simply take a nice clean rag and clean up all the oil residue. That way it doesn't get caked on, keeps it clean. And then up here on the surface, you wanna get that nice and clean, make sure the old gasket is out of the way. So you go hand tight, just like that. And then a little bit more. That's it. That's all you need. Done. Okay, so back on the top of the engine, like before, here's our fill plug. Get that off. Get our funnel. Now we have our five quarts of synthetic 5W30. All right, so at this point, I'm gonna leave the oil level where it is. I put about five and a half quarts in. I'm gonna start the motor, let it run, cycle it through the filter. The filter will uh, fill up with the rest of the oil that it needs, and then I'll let it sit five minutes, check the oil again. If it's in the middle, leave it. If it needs a little more, you can add a little more. Another oil change done. This time on a 2019 Explorer with the inline four. 5W30 synthetic oil change, doing it every 5,000 miles. 
So again, all you need, the filter, six quarts of oil, 15 millimeter socket, a drain pan, a piece of cardboard, and a rag. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Subscribe for more like it. Thanks.